Hey guys, welcome back! Holy fuck, I cannot see shit. It is dark in this cave that we've fallen into after the ocelot fight. Also, hi, yes, it's been a while. I've had computer problems, but they are sorted now. Brand new system, very happy. Um, I cannot see shit. Now, I'm pretty certain that I have missed an item that would have really helped in this situation, the night vision goggles. I definitely did not pick those up, did I? That... that is unfortunate. That is very unfortunate. Um... Fuck. That means we're gonna be stumbling about in this place with no real... direction, which, uh... I mean, unless you can find them in here, but I re I cannot see fuck all. Like, seriously, I, I can just about see some walls. Um, do I have my cigar? My cigar is probably the only way I'm going to get through this. Um, is it a frickin... Oh, is it not a weapon? Well, I, I guess that would be silly, but cigar, right. We're going to be doing some smoking. It's very bad for you guys. It's very bad for you, but we have no choice. Highly addictive and hazardous to your health. Okay. Yes, we can see a little bit now. And our health is going down constantly, which sucks. Oh, there's a snake on the floor. Fuck me, that's scary. Uh, I'm going to take you. And also, well, I, I don't think I need my suppressor yet. Snake H. Okay. Um, wow. I might have to actually, like, adjust the brightness of my monitor. Oh, we found... We found, uh... You know what? I'm gonna be right back, okay? I need to, like, be able to see. Okay, uh, I've had to close my blinds completely. I hope that helps, because this game, apparently, has no... Brightness adjustment within the game. It says adjust the monitor brightness Well, that's great. I don't really want to have to do that because then I'll have to fuck around with it again Afterwards, so we're just gonna try and struggle through this I suppose uh, Also because I've it's been like over a week since I played this all my food has gone off All my fucking food so I mean that's kind of cool But also very annoying Um I mean, we still have, like, instant noodles, calorie mate. We'll be fine. We've still got, you know, some things in the cages. But this food will come in handy for a boss fight, so... Yeah, and uh, as you can see, Snake's got the cigar in his mouth. Although you can't really see it. There we go. Very cool. Right. Oh, yeah, that's really done nothing for me, to be honest. <laughs> I still can't see shit. Oh, we found some water. I might try and, like, adjust the brightness in editing, perhaps. I know there's a... Oh, we're swimming. I know there's a waterfall somewhere in these caves. And also a shotgun that we really want to find before we get too far... Uh, into it. I have no idea if I'm going the right way. Like, cigars just let you see yourself. I see nothing of my surroundings whatsoever. Oh, hello. Can I climb? No, nope, I didn't want to swim. Although I I can see a lot better swimming. Holy shit. How does that make any sense? Alright, we have a little platform here. Can I climb it, please, Snake? There's a good lad. Um, I don't know how your cigar didn't go out. Wait, it, we unequip- Oh, we unequipped it. That's cool. That's realistic. Alright, now we can see a bit better. Now it's better. we got to watch out for bats, though. I know there's bats in these caves. And glow caps. Glow caps are useful for seeing. So we're going to take those. We've got a battery for our uh, non-existent night vision goggles. Let's make cable. It's now... Is there somewhere to crawl into? I know there's some, like, little tunnels and shit. I guess not here? 
Oh, I never usually have this many problems with this area. Because I've usually got the fucking goggles. Looks like we're going back for a... For a swim? Maybe? I know my health's going down. I really... It, it'll be fine. It'll regenerate. We'll be good. But I've missed you guys. I've missed playing this game. And hello. Ah. Now we are going for a swim. With the weirdest swimming sounds ever. Where is this going to take us? Oh, it's a froggy! Did you see the frog then? And daylight! That still doesn't really do much for us. Wait a minute, where am I going? What was the point of this little area? What was the point? I can't get out anywhere. Other than... Oh, there is an item below us, isn't there? Was that an item I just saw? It was a ration. Okay, well, we've got a ration, guys. Shit. I'm running out of breath. Come on, snake. Oh, my God. Oh, come on. We can do it. We can do it. Yes. Whew. Okay. We've really not done much, though. Like, I still don't know where I'm going. Not one bit. In fact, let's, uh, let's have a call. Let's see if we can... Oh, there we go. God, I thought the game had crashed. Any hints, guys? Any hints? Snake, are you okay? Snake! <laughs> Major. Snake. Are you alright? You're not hurt? No. That was a hell of a drop, but I'm fine. Looks like there's no way back up, though. I see. Well, anyway, it's good to hear you're not injured. Slipping and falling may not have been part of the plan, but getting into that cave was. Proceed further into the cave. The cave seems to be structured like a maze. Yeah, no shit. It somewhere. Find a way out of the cave and head for the aqueduct. How do you know there's an exit? I mean, there might not be. From where we fell in, there might not be a way out. I mean, there is, but uh, it's going to take me probably two videos to find it. Snake, are you all right? Yeah, just barely. What the hell were all those hornets? Most likely that was the pain, one of the cobras. I figured as much. Are they tracking me? I don't know. The cobras only take orders from the boss. Not even Volgan knows what they're really up to, so I don't know anything about them either. No kidding. I'll try and dig up as much as I can about them. You just focus on moving ahead. Go to the end of the cave and you'll come out in an aqueduct overgrown with mangroves. This leads to the Ponizovie swamp. And Snake, be careful. That cave is it's really dark inside. Yeah. Good. I did remember to tell you then. Um. If no. It's completely dark and you need a light. Try using a torch. I heard there's some emergency torches stored somewhere in that cave. Oh, great. Torches. Got it. So where are they? Huh? Where are the torches? How should I know? Go find them yourself. Oh, thanks, Eva. Great. Yeah, there's some torches in that really dark cave you can't see. You know, can't see me cock in front of me balls, goddammit. So there are some torches somewhere. That fills me with confidence that we might be able to get out if we do find them, but... I think I've gone back to where I started. Which is fine, because I do know there is a... Another, like, way we can go. Over here, maybe? I'm sure there's a, a place you can crawl into. Yeah, we, need, we need to find a way to crawl into this really damp, dark cave. I think I've actually found the way I usually go. I can't fucking tell. It's too... I, I really do not remember it being this dark. Oh, hello. Ah, this is the waterfall. I knew there was one. Okay, making progress. The problem is, I just know that I am missing tons of items. Oh, what's that? Oh, we found a torch, guys! Yes! Yes! Right, goodbye cigar. Hello, torch. 
thank God. Okay, we might get through this place. Um, put the cigar away. Don't really need my cardboard box right now. Or the croc cap, to be honest. Um, oh, is the torch a weapon? It is. Wonderful. Okay. Let's get this bad boy on the go. Yes! White phosphorus grenade and tons of crabs, which I'm going to take because they are probably tasty. Even though I'm not a big fan of seafood. In fact, can we hit them with the torch? Oh, yeah! Kentucky for ad crab! Oh, we got a mushroom. We didn't get the crabs. But we've got crabs, guys! Can you not kill the crabs with the torch? Dude! Come on now, Snake, you can do this. There we go. He just has the worst aim ever. Fried crab. I mean, that's got to be tasty, right? And in fact, we could do with eating some. Because we are a little bit low on stamina. So let's do that. Let's eat some crab. Kenyan mangrove crab. Yeah, I thought he'd like that. I thought he'd like that. Alrighty, let's get a few more. Let's... Whoops. Oh, we can turn it on and off. Huh. Huh. Amazing. What happened to this poor chap, though? Who was he? He's been there a while. Will you please hit the fucking crab snake? There you go. I just wanted maybe one or two more. I know they're probably going to go off before I eat them. There we go. Right, okay. Now we can have a look around. There's tons of crabs. Alright, so. Wait a minute. Was this not the way I was supposed to go then? It's just a dead end. Okay. I thought I knew the layout of this place, but evidently not. Ah, that's where we crawl through. Okay. Oh, hang on. Where's this go? If this leads to the water, this is where I just went before, isn't it? Oh, maybe not. Oh, hey, rats. And a snake! Oh my god. What kind of snake is that? Can I torch it? Snake, seriously, dude. Oh no! Oh god! Oh, you dick! Snake, honestly, dude. You're an idiot. Alright? You're a fucking idiot. You just let that happen. It was two inches in front of your face. And you didn't think to torch it. I don't know why I've got the TNT equipped still. But anyway, let's, uh... Oh, in fact, we don't have enough cage space, do we? Alright. You're dying, Snakey. Snake B. Have we had Snake B before? Oh, it's a Taiwanese Cobra. Bloody bastard. Well, he's dead now. Grenades. Bullets. I know there's a shotgun somewhere in this fucking cave. That's really gonna help for the next upcoming part of the game. I really would like to uh, find it. Is this where we went? Oh, this is where we started. I completely missed that camo. All right, we got uniform animals. And that's where we went. So I'm just going to quickly just... Uh... Can I swim with my torch? Yes, I can. Excellent. We're just going to have a poke around here. I do see there's an item down there. Is it going to tell me what it is? Or am I going to have to swim down for it? We're swimming. 
What was the gun? Oh, it's just bullets, really? It's just bullets! God damn. Okay. I actually cannot be bothered going this way, so we're just gonna go back and crawl into that little hole. Uh. Wait, wait a minute, where did I, uh... Okay, here we go. Look at the froggies! Man, a whole video just gonna be fucking around in this cave. Good stuff, good times, good, good times. Nope, okay. And here we go. Oh, you can crawl with the torch. That's cool. Hey, Froggy. Hey, Froggy. Froggy. Oh, did you hear the noise it made? I'm so sorry, Mr. Frog. Desperate times, though. Well, I didn't actually need the food, to be honest. I'm just going to leave that dude alone. He's gone back down there going, Hey, Bill, where have you gone? Bill! Oh, you son of a cock. Just lying in wait there. I freaking hate that, man. You're dying straight away. I'm not even entertaining your bullshit. Food is... F we've filled our food quota already? I'll be damned. Right, now we should be just above the waterfall now. Yeah, we've got some serum. Get up, snake, you pillock. Alrighty, cool. Now, where, oh, where is the bastard shotgun? Ah, there are bats in here. I can hear them. Another dead dude. And some provisions. Oh no! Oh god! I feel like Bruce Wayne. In Batman Begins. God, that was such a good scene. Right, anyway, we're into the second area of the cave. It should be a lot brighter. From what I remember, it's not nearly as bad as that first area. We might not even need the torch, really. Oh no, we totally do. We totally do. Right, now, if I remember, is the shotgun this way? Is it over here? Oh god! Oh, they're attacking me, bastards! Yes, we got the shotgun, guys! We got the sh Oh, I just walked over a snake. Leave me be! Leave me be! Be gone! Go on, you bastards. How am I not hitting any of them? There we go. Oh. So sorry, guys. But you are being dicks. Of course, if you turn the torch off, they can't do anything. So, um, so we can go one of two ways here, I think. Crawl in here. Or we could go back the other way, but we'll see what's this way first. Okay. Oh, another uniform. Damn, snow. When would we use that? When would we use that camo? Effective against white bat. Oh, I know when. I know when. Much later in the game. Uh, how f how fabulous is this though? That's freaking just amazing. In fact, I'm just gonna wear that just for shits and gigs. Um, not sure if it makes animals less wary of you. I don't really know. Hey, Mr. Crab. 
So many crabs. So many crabs in this dark cave. And this apparently just goes on forever. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Now... Aha! Right, that is the exit. But I want to go back this way just to make sure I haven't missed anything. Oh shit. Will you fuck off, bats? Seriously? You piss off? There's a, oh, there's a snake right there. Oh. Oh, fuck you guys. Alright, smoke grenade. Bullets full. So really nothing else. I really not miss anything else going this way. Uh, I guess not. That's where we went. Okay, no, looks like we've got everything. Uh, right. We have, a, we have a bit of fun coming up, chaps. Yes, we do. Piss off. Here we go. Right, in fact, before, uh, before I begin this, I'm going to get rid of my torch. Going to... I mean, grenades would probably be useful. As you can probably guess, there's a bit of a boss fight coming up. Uh... I think all I'm going to... I'm going to try... Well, I'm trying to do this, like, non-lethally, so... Really, all I should need is my Trank gun. Uh, and that's probably all I'm going to use. Although, I, no, I will need the shotgun as well. I know, non-lethal shotgun? Mm, you'll see. You will see. I uh, don't think I need anything else, really. Let's do this. Yeah, that's definitely a good idea. I've caught you at last. We are the sons of the boss. I am the pain. <laughs> I will guide you to a world of anguish beyond your imagination. Let's get started. Oh, now this dude, he doesn't look it, but apparently he's six foot seven. He's a fucking giant. Now, uh, he's picked a pretty shitty arena to fight us in, to be honest, because this water is going to help us a lot more. Oh, shit. Right, yeah, so... Basically, just avoid the bees by swimming lots. Oh, shit. Ow! Bastard! Didn't see that. He does protect himself with the hornets, which is what I've got the shotgun for. Oh, dude. I mean, no idea how that works exactly, but fuck it. You can't hit me. Oh shit, you can. <laughs> okay, I'll hide behind here. Well, let's let's just see what people have to say about him first. That's always fun. The pain has the power to control swarms of hornets at will. You don't say. Watch out for his hornet-based attacks. You don't say. Wow, that was good advice, Eva. Thanks. Thanks for that. That's totally gonna help me. Snake, as long as the pain is using his hornets to protect his body, you won't be able to damage him with gun attacks. You'll need to use a grenade to get rid of the hornet swarm first. 
go into first person view and throw a grenade at him. Yeah, that's actually pretty the difficult. Shotgun should work as well. The shotgun, that's Get what I'm talking about. Protecting him and then attack him with a gun. I'm not going to attack him with my cock, am I? The pain is said to possess the power to control his hornets at will. I don't know where people Watch are getting this info from. Based attacks, especially his so-called bullet bees. Bullet bees. It sounds like a fucking Mario enemy. Oh, man. Right, okay. So they didn't really tell me much that I didn't already know. Oh, you sod. Grenade! No, 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 no. Oh, yeah, shit. You can shoot them before it reaches you. Shit. Forgot about that. Come on, show yourself. That's a good lad. In the face. So yeah, I'm trying to get his stamina down. That's the whole uh, strategy. Oh shit. Swim behind cover, snake. Ha! Shit, I can't hit him from there. Oh, dude, I totally hit him then. Go, my brother. Oh, shit. Ow. Alright, one snake, quick, quick, quick. That's too close. Oh, dude. I'm sucking so bad in this fight. Not another one. Yes. What? How did that? Shit, maybe you can't do it with the Trank Gun. Oh my god, Snake, aim at him. Oh my god. Ow. This is taking a while. Doing it non-lethally sucks. Fuck off, bees. Tommy Gun, give me chance, man. I almost forgot then that Snake can't actually like breathe underwater. <laughs> oh, we had to reload then. Oh, please. I prefer to hit him in the head. There we go. Okay, we got some good hits on him there. Okay. We can do this. Just got whittling down. In fact, I should really eat something. Because my stamina isn't perfect. Let's eat... The Otten Frog. We've not eaten that yet. Pretty tasty. Nice. Oh. Son of a bastard. Grenade! Alright, that did kind of work. Fuck off. Is that the end? Oh no, he's just transforming. Oh! Oh my god! Okay, I, I completely forgot about this second bit. Oh shit. Go, get Fucking bullet bees! Right, I'm gonna swim... Well, I probably shouldn't actually swim too far from that cover, to be honest. And you found me. Oh, will you stop? Right, let's... Grenade! Let's actually use the shotgun. There we go. Hey. 
Come on. Ah, son of a bastard. No, no, no. This is going to sting. <laughs> Literally, this is going to sting. I think we dodged him. Oh, you don't want to do that, mate. Come on, show yourself. Come out and play. Get him. Shit. Hey, right, he's, he's he's exposed. He's exposed. I was bastard. I'm running out of darts, so I've got to got to be a bit careful here. No, no, no. Ha. Oh, shit. I didn't actually want him to get hit by that. Son of a bitch. Uh-oh. That's going to hurt. Oh, not quite. He is a weird guy. Ooh, that was a good hit. We've nearly got him. We nearly got him. Grenade. Oh, piss off with your fucking grenade bastards. Oh, quick. Why aren't I shooting him in the head? Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. He is so close to being, well, knocked out. We're not actually trying to kill him. That was kind of silly. Why am I doing this? It's like conducting the bees. Or the hornets, whatever you want to call them. Where's he gone? What the shit? I didn't realize he did that. Oh, fuck. Well, I don't have any more fucking shotgun rounds. Oh shit. Come on, Snake. Oh, for God's sake, I just need like one more hit on him. Show yourself. No. Yes, finally. One cobra down, guys. Doing it non uh, non lethally sucks. <laughs> wow. But now that we've done that, if I'm correct in thinking, we might get his camo. Let's see if we can get up to. How do we get up to his platform? I'm sure there's a way. Getting his camo. How do we get his camo? How do we get up there? Uh. Hmm. I'm not actually sure how we get his camo. I might have to look that up. Because I know you can get it. How would 
could we get onto there? Hmm. Ah. Is there a way? Ah, okay. I think I know. I think I know. Let's have a quick word with people, though. Let's see how impressed they are that we killed one of the legendary cobras. Snake, you beat the pain. Not without a tough fight. How did it feel to fight one of the boss's comrades? What are you getting at? There's a rat pain in the ass. I just ah. want to know what it's like to have fought a member of the legendary cobra unit. That's all. What you want to know is if I can really face the boss. Is that right? Well, that too. Don't waste your time worrying about me. I'll get the mission done. I certainly hope so. So the exit of the cave is up ahead? Right. Go to the end of the cave and you'll come out in an awkward Oh yeah, you've told me that. You've told me that, Eva. Thank you. The exit from the cave. Okay, you're not even impressed that I beat the pain? Major? You serious? I see you've caught a king cobra. Yeah. The king cobra is the world's largest venomous snake. It's also a right bastard. Sorry, I'm right. I'm skipping all this stuff. Okay. Right, so only Eva really gave a shit that we just beat the pain. But that's okay. You know, we don't need people to pat us on our back and tell us we're awesome. Because we already know. We know we're awesome. <sighs> Although I did make a bit of a pig's ear of it. Let's get... I can't... Why is this area so fucking dark? This is what you're supposed to do. I wonder if you could have done this in the fight itself. Fighting him up here would actually... I mean, apart from when he gets his Tommy gun out. Oh, am I going to have to jump across this? The commando roll? Yeah. There we go. Uniform Hornet Stripe. So let's see what that does. Camouflage. Hornet Stripe. I can't remember what that does. Uh, maybe, maybe it just means you're immune to hornets from, like, hornets' nests and stuff. It looks pretty cool. Yeah, pretty snazzy, pretty snazzy. I've not got this camo that often. Uh, I can never be bothered to kill him non-lethally, so... Anywho. We're gonna get out of these bastard caves. Not a moment too soon. Right. Any more snakes about? We're actually coming up to the area where the crocodile cap is really going to come in handy. Huh. What the hell are those? Yeah, this is uh, this is the 1960s, but it's Metal Gear World, so. Yeah. Ooh, got some fruit on the floor. I'm gonna have this tasty snake. I said I'm gonna have this tasty snake. I said I'm gonna have this tasty snake. <laughs> Thank you. About bloody time. Now, what are these fruits called? I used to always remember the name of them. And isn't it weird that we can't just pick them up? We have to actually knife them. Wait a minute. Why is your aim terrible, Snake? Oh, we got some D-Med from that. and our food is full. Uh, let's have another... Let's eat the Taiwanese Cobra. Get some revenge. Oh, we get to see it. Even though we're not wearing our bandana anymore, apparently. I think we were supposed to eat a snake properly in the Virtuous Mission. But yeah, damn, he's... He's eating that thing raw. Oh, no 
Looking at right, piggy yourself, snake. Damn, son. Not too bad. Alright, let's get this fruit. Gotta have a balanced diet. R fruit B. Now, if I remember correctly, he doesn't actually like this. Yeah, Russian false mango. He doesn't actually like that. Tastes like shit, apparently. Um, I did see there's a poison frog there, but I don't really need it. Let's go over here. Always thought there should be something on this ledge. Maybe there is in a different difficulty, but on normal, there is nothing there. There's just so many fucking snakes, man. And a room full of bats. And mines! Holy shit, I forgot about the claymores in there. Just barely see them. That means we're crawling. I'm going to collect a few of them. Again, it's very difficult to see. I do realise this. It's not quite as bad as the cave, though. Some claymores. Okay, bullets are full. Right. I'm trying to think when the next time we're going to find some guards. I don't think there's any in the cave. Uh, is it glow cap mushrooms that can restore your battery if you eat them? Or something like that. It's really weird. It's like electrically charged mushrooms make you be able to use your goggles more. And I still don't know where the fuck the night vision goggles were. Um, I also really want to find the thermal goggles sooner rather than later. But I'm not, again, I'm not sure where they are either. Right. A very iconic area of the game, this is. I remember seeing it a lot in the trailers. But uh, this is where we're going to end it for now, guys. I'm going to quickly phone uh, Paramedic to save. To see if she wants to talk about another film of the era. Do you want to save? And I keep on forgetting to show this, so I'm going to show it this time. Checking hard disk. Come on, come on, save. Quicker. Quicker, goddammit. Thank you. Snake, have you heard of The Last War? Nope, doesn't ring a bell. It's a Japanese movie where the world ends in a nuclear war. Tensions between East and West reach the breaking point, and before anyone can stop it, they launch the ICBMs. Humanity is wiped out by a war that no one wanted. The movie depicts that destruction from the eyes of ordinary people. Their simple daily lives are torn apart by the terrible power of a war that has nothing to do with them. Everybody's afraid of the next big war, but there's only so much that one person can do. That's why the people who have the power to stop it have to. I agree. It's pretty fucking scary. Pretty fucking scary. Right, thanks for watching, guys. Hope you've enjoyed this. Um... I have not got a proper outro video clip currently on this new system, so it's just going to end and be really awkward. But uh, thank you so much for watching, hope you've liked this, and we've got this to deal with next time. Which is where the crocodile cap should come in handy. Hopefully. Yeah, looking forward to trying it. So, I'll see you next time, guys. Thanks for being patient and waiting for this, I know it's been a while. Couldn't be helped, sadly, but uh, now we're back in the swing of things.